It was that suit. It was so real. He was coming to get us. He was coming to get us all. I gotta go get May. Well, nothing. Nothing. We've widened the search. Ram's just vanished. Ram, or his rotting body, must be found. I can't stay here. It's filthy. I'll die. I'm ill. I need things. Medicines somewhere sterile, germ-free. Is that right? My system needs special conditions. I've got to be monitored. I need a special hygienic regime. No dust, no germs. Special food. <laughs> Something amusing you? Nope. But I'm beginning to see why somebody dumped you on a rubbish tip. I could die! Okay, could you like just get on with it? I got a heap of other things to do. What's the word out there? For what it's worth, Ram was dumped on a garbage tip. A what? Where? Let's go! Too late. He's vanished. Garbage tip. Jeez, do you think he'd survive that? Statistically, I'd say the odds were heavily against. Maybe 80-20. Or 85. If only he'd used his homing beacon, we could have tracked him. Maybe he did. No way. We, we would have known. What? Batteries. Stats! I asked you to remember. Remember? What are we going to do about her? She's getting to be a real liability. He's got to be out there somewhere. Most likely dead. No, no. When we would have found the body by now, they've searched the city with a fine-tooth comb. Calm down. I've never seen you like this. You're Mr. Cool, remember? Java, you know what Ram is capable of. Suppose he finds someone to help him, get him stuff he needs so he can sit up again. You know the first people he's going to be looking for. Person. What? The first person, not people. I'm your prisoner, remember? I was on Ram's side. I mean, if that's what we want the city to believe, then he'll believe it too. It's a joke. <laughs> We're in this together. Oh, would you lighten up? Everything's going well. I'm moving in on Ebony today. Em, we need to talk. About? A lot of things. Paradise, this whole zoot thing. I think Lex is right. I think it's just a practical joke gone wrong. The kids out there are so screwed up, they'll believe anything. Zoot is dead. We burned his body in a boat, Bray and I. It's just a very, very bad joke. Then the sooner we get the headsets and the sooner we can clean this mess up. Like I said before, Jay, it's your mess, not mine. You don't think you're being a bit unreasonable, Amber? 
Getting the headsets in was your idea. Excuse me. Good, was she? What? Better than me. You're not saying that... Why not? You haven't been able to keep your eyes off her ever since she came back. Ebony, we've been through this. Maybe you've been playing me along all the while. Maybe that DVD of you and Amber in cyberspace wasn't in cyberspace after all. Maybe it was in real time. You're being paranoid. Oh, well, paranoid as well as insane, is that it? Is that the story you're both cooking up? Oh, you just listen to me, Jay. No, you listen to me. You're seeing things that don't exist, and it's destroying you piece by piece. Nothing is going on between me and Amber, got it? Nothing. Not from where I'm standing. Morning. Hi. Ugh, look at me. Like I've been dragged through a hedge backwards. It's okay for you. What, you mean nobody want to beat my brains out because I'm untidy? You know what I mean. A pickaxe handle isn't going to care what shade of lipstick you've got on. But... Oh, get down. Oh, uh, watch my hair! Somebody coming! Who is it? How do I know? It could have been someone I knew. Well, excuse me for wanting to survive. Do you, do you want me to get him back and we'll, we can invite him back for tea? Now you're being silly. I'm being silly. I'm the one who wants to find a safe place. Nowhere is a safe place. The mall with my friends. That's where we should be going, gal. Not out into nowhere. I'm not going back to the city. No way. I don't want to bump into Zoot. Look, listen to scenes. Siva, bear with me, please. You think I wanted her just to turn up? You think I enjoy seeing you hurt like this? But you're going to keep looking for her, right? Maybe she doesn't want to be found. Say again? Maybe she saw how things are with you and me. Maybe she's clearing the way for us. If I thought that were true, I'd give up looking for her right now. But I have to give her the chance to say all of that. To put all of this away for good. You've got to let me do that. Hey, have you seen this guy? No, I'm sorry. Mouse, you all by yourself? Yeah, they're all gone. Who? Who've all gone? Celine, Pride, and Naomi. She's gone. Who, who's gonna be next? Hey, I'm here. And Amber, and Jay. But what about when you're not here? Who's gonna look after me then? Listen, I'm sure we'll find them. It's Zoot, isn't it? Zoot. He's taking them. He's bad. Mouse, that is all just silly gossip. Who's been saying that to you? Sammy, he said, he said that Zoot's gonna get us all, all the Morats, because you wasted him. Well, 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 Mr. Hero. You playing any coups lately? I don't have time for the sex. Oh no, I forgot. You need people to help you with that, don't you? Like Tysan. Look, I'm sorry you haven't found her, but... But she served her purpose, right? That's not how it was, Lex, and you know it. No, I don't know that. All I know... All I know is that she was back in my life for ten minutes. And it was, it was just... It was long enough to... I wish I could help. Yeah. Look... If you want to take your mind off things, we could use your help. Doing what? Collecting headsets. You've got the amnesty. Yep, that's from the sensible ones. We still need to collect from those that don't want to give them up. We can use all the help we can get. I'll think about it. Come to the 
think of it, I do remember May saying something about going away for a couple of days just to be on her own. Really? Is she really? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, I remember her saying that now. Do you think they look alike? Well, they are cousins. Hmm. Will they ever see their daddy? We were just finished, so I'll see you later, Trudy. Mouse, can you finish this? Sure. Jay. <laughs> Don't blame her. Is this how it's gonna be from now on? Her avoiding me? Me feeling like a heel every time I look at her? She needs time. We had a trust between us. Now, all I feel is disappointment. I've lost her friendship. That, I'll have to live with. But if she can't forgive me for what happened to Bray... <sighs> I will speak to her. Hey, uh, Slade, you got a minute? Look, what I said earlier. Things, they just got on top of me, you know? I mean, hell, I'm grateful you brought me here. Not everybody would help a man not even knowing who he was. So, who are you? The name's Gabe. It's short for Gabriel. <laughs> so, uh, tell me, Slate. Just where are we? Tell me, Gabe. Who's Mega? Mega? The guy you shout about in your sleep. Oh, if I'm disturbing you at nights, look, I'm, I'm real sorry. He's the guy who dumped you, right? Friends argue. He'll pay for it. I bet he's trembling in his boots. Okay, everyone, listen up. We might be ex-technos, but we have to stick together. The soup business has stirred up a lot of crazies out there. Stay in twos and threes, any more could be seen as a threat. The headset amnesty, Anybody volunteers a headset, take it. I'll direct them to a collection point. Any questions? How do we deal with violence? Play it cool. Withdraw. Only use your weapons if you have to. There's a lot of bad feeling out there. Do nothing to aggravate it. This has to be handled delicately. Headsets. Thank you. I know why you're here, Trudy. Then you know what I'm gonna say. I just can't get around the fact that he was part of Bray's death. I can't. Look at him. It's like Mouse said, he'll never know his father. <sighs> Sorry, I... I didn't mean it badly. No, it's okay. It's okay. Now I know what you must have gone through. Well, I had you to help me. And Bray. You must miss him almost as much as I do. He was the best. And you were the best thing to happen to him. So don't spend too much time blaming. He wouldn't have wanted it. Did you know that Jay lost his brother too? Bud? I, I knew he was missing, but um... No. No, I didn't. So now he has to live with the fact that the system he helped set up killed the only brother he had. Right, uh, you stay here and I'll, I'll, go, I'll go check out of town. You're kidding. Well, you know, it might be dangerous, so... If you were a bad guy, would you choose to live in a place called Liberty? What would that do to your street cred? Yes. 
door. I killed for some wipes. Yeah, look, uh, just keep walking, eh? Okay, let's, uh, let's get off the streets. Is that the best you could do? It's a start. That doesn't even scratch the surface. I didn't see you out there. I said I'd think about it, which is exactly what I did. Nothing in it for Lex, that it? No, I just don't see myself taking orders from Technos. My men have been out there all day to bring those in. If you have any better ideas, let's hear them. I'm sorry, Mr. Techno, but that is your problem. You produced them, you get rid of them. But just remember, if there's any left out there when the power comes back on. Ooh. Oh, thanks. Hey, uh, you know what we were talking about earlier? About that guy, Mega. In the circumstances, if somebody was to uh, collect from him, it could be very profitable for that person. Your revenge, friend, is your business. Revenge? Can you really see me taking revenge from a bed, helpless? I've got no way of fighting back, I've got nothing! So just how do you suppose I take revenge, Slade? If you want it badly enough, You'll find a way. Hey, you! Lex! Have you found Tysan yet? No. Have you? I told you. Uh, it's not your problem? We're rubbish. I think you're holding out on me. Why would I do that? Because you're a techno. Maybe I should beat it out of you. If it makes you feel better. Look, if there's anything I can tell you that might help, you just have to ask. Okay. How did Tysan fit into the system? Was she programmed? Threatened? Forced to act? What? Well, Rem favored her strongly. Favored? You might not want to hear this. He wanted her. In fact, he was planning on taking her with him into cyberspace. What? But we both know he never went into cyberspace. So what are you saying? You really want to find Tysan? Find Ram. Odds are, that's where she'll be. My tribe, the Modes. We used to raid for cosmetics. Jack, would you do my hair at the back? Please. As I was saying, we Modes, we were wicked. My friend Belle, right? She had long, long nails and really cool hair. She had like the whole manicure. Hey. Going somewhere? The headset hunt. Jay asked if I could help find some of the ones that are hidden away. Can it wait? Well, it seems not. You could go first thing in the morning. I thought I'd spend some time out there trying to find Ram. Yeah? Will this be before or after you found the headsets? Well... Bro! Who do you think you're trying to kid, Lex? You've got wind of Tysan, haven't you? No. What is it? You heard of somebody who saw her out there balanced on one foot in disguise facing east? You don't own me. Wait a minute. You found her. Why else would you be in such an all fired hurry to get away? Leave me alone. I bought you some champagne. It's a good vintage, straight from the tap. Oh, what's this? The Iron Maiden crying? Please, please help me. I'm so frightened. 
I'm scared. What if they don't find Ram? What's gonna happen to me then? You should have thought about that before you trashed Ram. But it, but it wasn't me. It was Jay and Amber. I'm not a fighter. Look at me. I'm just a helpless, frightened girl. Don't even think about it. You. No violence. What? I said no violence. We want her in one piece, don't we? At least if they don't find Ram, I'm gonna have the pleasure of dealing with you. It's where we used to come when we had time. It's heard most of the things we had to say to each other. Really big you came. Oh? I wondered, after what you said about Zoot. I was concerned. For me? You are my sister. And you, you think I'm going crazy. I didn't say that. Well, why not? Everybody else does. Why can't they see Java? It was meant to be. And they can't destroy Zoot. Zoot is a god. You remember the Guardian? He was right. He was a prophet. If only I'd seen it then. You see it now? Yes, I see it. I see him now. He's in this room with us. Why is it only me? It's not only you, Ebony. I can see him too. <laughs> 